Hey, welcome back to Triple R. Today we're going to take a look at a game called Uzi Earth Adventure. It's on Steam for $4.99. Pretty sure I got it for like a dollar. I would suggest not paying more than a dollar for this game. Um, it looks good and plays good. It just gets boring kind of quickly. Um, let's take a look at it. Here's the blurb about it here. Uh, Uzi Earth Adventure is a classic 2D platformer with old school gameplay. No puzzles, no punishment, just platforming. So that is true. Although, there's something that could be kind of puzzle-esque, maybe. Um, HD visuals, hand-drawn art. So it does look very good, has good music. So we'll take a look at it, and um, I'll show you like what I mean. Uh, why it's kind of boring. So I go play a game here. I'm almost done with story mode on easy. It got so boring I just quit, so I need to finish it one day, but that'd probably be my like fourth time trying to play it. So we'll just go on the uh, arcade mode so you can see some of the graphics and how it plays. So World 1 is a tutorial, so there's nothing really there. We'll go to like 1-4. It has a nice art style. It does sound good. And the gameplay, control-wise, is very uh, spot on. So I can't <laughs> complain much about that. This one has a nice rain uh, graphic to it so there's your guy Uzi you can duck down a little bit well sometimes we'll move the camera down up so you can see you collect stars just for points you don't do anything these will tell you what's, what's going to happen here so you can't fall in the water and you can jump on a lot of enemies not all get rid of them you can double jump of course Double tap uh, A or your jump button. And really, you don't need to engage enemies. You just need to get through the levels and progress. But, so, the music is very good. The graphics are good. It, you know, it's a nice um, art style. See, this guy has little spikes, so I can't jump on him. So I'll get hurt. See? And you have uh, those hearts up there are your life, how many hits you can take. The game is pretty generous with checkpoints which is nice, so you don't have to keep um, going back too far, like in like a Mega Man or something like that. Oh, that's right, these are arcade modes. Arcade is a timed event. That little gray box would be a checkpoint where you would start your um, your story game over if you, uh, you died or whatever. You would start from that point and go on. So, let's look at another level really quick. Uh, we'll go down to, um, I don't want to spoil too many worlds in case you do want it. <laughs> Maybe a dark world, I guess. Okay, so it's like caves. Um, so the first world is a nice bright world, kind of like a Mario, Super Mario kind of world. You can tell you what to do. Can't jump on these guys. It'll like, um, end your run here. Like I said, the gameplay is pretty spot on, like your movement, it controls really well. And then you can wall jump, Get some uh, that Ninja Gaiden style there, yeah, like 20 seconds, like a hit. So this is Uzi, Earth Adventure, little alien, he's trying to get back to his, his ship I think. Um, for five bucks, I think it's too much because it gets boring so quickly. Uh, for less than five bucks, even maybe two, it is for casual and it looks good. It plays solid. Uh, score out of ten, I would give like a solid six point five. I think. I think it's a fair, a fair score. Um, so I'm not gonna overly recommend this game. It's definitely casual. Uh, it's a little long for what it is. But it does have a couple modes, like this arcade mode, I don't really know, it's a speed run kind of mode, which is nice. And then it has the story mode. So maybe I, you know what, I mean, a story mode, a challenge mode, which I haven't done, an arcade mode. So I would, three modes of play, and the way it looks and plays, I'll, I'll bump it up to, I really don't want to give it a 7. It's a 6.5 game. 
So thanks for watching Triple R. Uh, it's currently not on sale right now. I would wait if you want to check it out for it to go on sale. Just add it to your wish list or whatever. So have a good day or night, wherever you are.